why did Barbados make Rihanna a national hero? In this video, we'll explore some of the real reasons. Robin Rihanna Fenty, known to the world as Rihanna or Riri, was born and raised on the Caribbean island of Barbados. She was introduced to the world in 2005 as a singer of the genres of R&B, pop, and dancehall. There was always a presence of Caribbean, West Indian influence in her music, the beginning of her homage to her island and region. With her voice and talent which captivated her audience, she acquired her first Grammy Award in 2007 for her third album, Good Girl Gone Bad. It was the first milestone achievement of many during her singing career. As of this recording, Rihanna has many music accolades, including 9 Grammy Awards, 8 Billboard Music Awards, and 13 American Music Awards. She is labeled one of the best-selling music artists of all time, and her rise does not stop there. Rihanna has ventured into acting, majoring in movies like Battleship in 2012, Home in 2017, and Ocean's 8 in 2018. As a blooming young businesswoman, Rihanna moved her talent and efforts into the fashion, makeup, and skincare industries. She has been a silent beast, setting trends, breaking boundaries, and humbling long-standing leaders in those industries. Her lingerie line, Savage X Fenty, launched in 2019 with a fashion show that aired on Amazon Prime, and it enthralled everyone. Rihanna's lingerie line broke so many fashion standards and norms by including women and, later on, men of all body types, sexual orientation, races, and physical abilities. Her makeup line, Fenty Beauty, released a boundary-breaking range of foundations in 50 shades in 2017. Very few makeup brands in that time had makeup foundations with the intention to cater to all skin shades. Click the link below to see an extensive selection of Fenty Beauty products by Rihanna that is designated to address a paucity of Fenty Beauty makeup line and skincare solutions that perform across all skin types and tones. See the link below. Rihanna, in her fame and ever-growing fortune, always maintained her humility. With every opportunity, she expressed intention to include everyone, no matter the religion, race, gender, sexual orientation, and physical ability. Her motives are always to make her fans and customers feel included. Though Rihanna's profile includes many humanitarian foundations and acts that we will later discuss, her role in the fashion and makeup industry is said to have touched countless lives positively. When everyone thought that this was the height of Rihanna's achievements in fashion industry, in 2019, she astonished the world by becoming the first black woman and woman from the Caribbean to head a luxury fashion house, LVMH, Monet Hennessy Louis Vuitton, with her clothing line, Fenty. She's like a gentle breeze, pleasant yet unstoppable. No one knows her next move, and she stunned the world in 2021 when Forbes announced Rihanna as the wealthiest female musician with an estimated net worth of over US $1.7 billion. In the background of all these global achievements, Rihanna has unassumingly been a diplomat for Barbados and a philanthropist, dedicating her time and fortune to helping the less fortunate, not only in Barbados and in the Caribbean, but around the world. In 2006, at about 18 years old, Rihanna created the Believe Foundation, a public organization inspired to protect children globally. 
The foundation aids children with severe illnesses such as cancer, AIDS, and leukemia. The foundation provides necessary supplies and funding to needy schools and donates clothing for children living in homeless shelters. The foundation has been in the media for its achievements in assisting children and recently, the foundation honored Rihanna in 2011. In 2012, Rihanna founded a non-profit organization, Clara Lionel Foundation, named in honor of her grandparents, Clara and Lionel Brathwaite. This foundation targets students attending college in the U.S. from Caribbean countries, including Barbados, and supports the Global Partnership for Education and Global Citizen Project that funds education for persons, mainly young girls, in over 60 countries. The Clara Lionel Foundation also funds emergency responses and disaster preparedness for countries globally. In September 2020, when Bahamas was devastated by Hurricane Dorian, her foundation provided more than $1 million in emergency response relief for food distribution, reconstruction of health care centers, waste management, and more. During the coronavirus pandemic in 2020, the Clara Lionel Foundation donated $5 million to help the struggling and vulnerable communities in the U.S. You can support the Clara Lionel Foundation by clicking the link just below in the description box. Rihanna has also hosted many charitable causes such as the annual Diamond Ball where A-list celebrities attend an event hosted by Rihanna. The celebrities are encouraged to donate generously to her foundation and other causes. But what does this mean for this small Caribbean island called Barbados? Rihanna carried her country, culture and Bayesian accent with her unapologetically wherever she went. In almost all her interviews, the name of her home island, Barbados, is on her lips and she would express how close her island is to her heart. As Rihanna gained fame, so did Barbados. Her foundation funds programs including the Clara Brathwaite Center for Oncology and Nuclear Medicine at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital in Barbados and several educational programs. These education programs have given several families in Barbados the opportunity to be lifted from poverty. During the pandemic, Rihanna donated money for ventilators, medical equipment, and food supplies to Barbados to help with their COVID response and management. The government of Barbados appointed Rihanna as an ambassador of education, tourism, and investment in 2018. During the appointment, the Prime Minister at the time, Mia Mormontley, stated that Rihanna has a deep love for this country, and this is reflected in her philanthropy especially in the areas of health and education. She also shows her patriotism in the way she gives back to this country and continues to treasure the island as her home. She has also demonstrated, beyond her success as a pop icon, significant creative acumen and shrewdness in business. It is therefore fitting that we engage and empower her to play a more definitive role as we work to transform Barbados. Rihanna understood the assignment and four years later, Rihanna and Mia Monsley would meet again at the celebration of Barbados becoming a republic as the island formally cut ties with the British monarchy and removed Queen Elizabeth as its head of state, almost 400 years after the first English ship arrived on this Caribbean island. Mia Motley was appointed president of the newly formed Republic of Barbados and the island honored the singer for proudly carrying her Bayesian heritage. On the very dawn that marked Barbados' first day as a republic, the government of Barbados publicly designated Robin Rihanna Fenty as a national hero. Mia Mortley would say to the singer as she received her accolade, Ambassador Robin Rihanna Fenty, on behalf of a grateful nation, but an even prouder people, we therefore present to you the designee for National Hero of Barbados, Ambassador Robin Rihanna Fenty. 
May you continue to shine like a diamond and bring honor to your nation by your works, by your actions, and to do credit wherever you shall go. God bless you, my dear. This honor of a national hero has only been given to 11 other Barbadians in history and as a national hero, she can now add the right honorable before her name. We can never guess what Rihanna will do next. Which ceiling is she going to break? But we can all expect that she will always honor and promote her island home and their wider Caribbean region. Does Rihanna deserve to be a designated nation hero of Barbados? It's a resounding yes. The right honorable Robin Rihanna Fenty has gotten recognition she rightly deserves. She is not just a pop star, fashion designer or cultural icon. She's an inspiration to millions across the globe. And Rihanna, today we celebrate your many successes and accomplishments. If you find this presentation valuable, we would be grateful if you share our channel with your friends and family. Plus, like, subscribe and click the notification bell for our future videos as we explore amazing Caribbean travel adventures and rich Caribbean lifestyles from one island to the next. Please write a comment and let us know your thoughts on the content of this video or suggest topics you would like to see us cover. Visit our hub at jari.com or click the link in the description below to subscribe to our blog or download some of our amazing free Caribbean recipes. Thank you again for watching and see you next time.